Young lady, you cannot come into this palace looking like this. <laughs> I don't understand. Let me ask you, are you here on invitation? <laughs> Excuse me? This is the people's palace. Do I need an invitation before I could come here? Says who? Says the king by himself. So get out of my way. Please, I don't want to be mad at you. Don't make me lose my composure. Leave. I'm not going anywhere until I see the queen. You are the last person the queen of this kingdom would want to see. Look at like this. No way. Please, leave. Listen, we need to understand ourselves. So we don't create unnecessary drama. And I'm... I came in quietly to see the queen and you have to let me do that. And I'm telling you that you cannot see the queen of Akama Kingdom. Go back to wherever you're coming from, dress properly and come back. There's nothing wrong with the way I'm dressed. I agree to what you said. But in this palace where we have defined rules, this dressing is indecent. I would advise you leave. What is going on here? I'm sorry. I humble myself before Her Majesty, Queen Asana of Akama Kingdom. You're welcome. Who is she? I'm Ivy, my queen. I'm a daughter of the soil. I came in to see you, but this one will not let me. And that is because her dressing will cause a problem. My queen, I am not happy that you use your royal eyes to look at this lady who is bereft of her manners. Azamana, quit the name calling. I'm sorry. Who taught you that? I'm sorry, my queen. He is right. You are not properly dressed. But as the daughter of the soil, I'll attend to you. Okay, my queen. Thank you. Come with me. Okay, my queen. You say your name is Ivy. Ivy Shukude, my queen. I'm a native of this kingdom. Ivy, I want you to go straight to the point. The king could work out any moment now, and he will not be happy to see me giving audience to somebody who is dressed like you are dressed. I'm sincerely sorry, my queen. I didn't know my the style of my dressing is going to be an issue. Please go straight to the point. My queen, what I'm about to say now may sound awkward to your hearing but believe me it's very painful to me because of the adverse effect it has on me your submission sounds very weighty already can you spill with the details i didn't want to go to the king to complain or to the wife of the man involved if i tell the king He's going to lose his highly exalted position. If I tell the wife, his family would be in shambo. So I decided to speak to you first because of your campaign against assault on the girl child. Ivy, save us the time and hit the nail on the head. My queen, I can't, I mean, it pains me that do you know who asked me out and I actually fell for it? I actually agreed. I'm sorry, I don't think I heard you well. What did you say? The owner who asked me to be his side chick. Initially, I didn't want to listen, but he insisted. Then I decided to date him and I went all out. He promised to buy me a car and make me comfortable as a lady. And I agreed. My queen, this is the eighth month. Ono has not bought me the car. Neither has he made me comfortable. Eh? I'm sorry. 
Which Onowu are we talking about here? The same Onowu, my queen. Onowu Uto Kanandu of Akama. I have come to plead with you, my queen. To please ask him to fulfill his promise to me. <laughs> Otherwise, nobody will be worse than me. No one will like how I'm going to handle this. My queen. Okay. I've heard you. I will look into it. Thank you, my queen. Thank you for giving me audience. I truly appreciate this. Let me also add that I would not like you to share this with any other person. As you know, the consequences would not be favorable to all parties involved. Allow me to handle it my way. Okay, my queen. Do you care for anything? No, my queen. Are you sure? If I need anything, I'll let you know, my queen. I, I mean, I won't hesitate to let you know if I need anything. All right, then. I have to be on my way now. Okay. Okay. Thank you, my friend. Take care now. Okay. Bye. Bye. Oh, no. Talk and No, I had the fun of my life today. Beauty, beauty. <laughs> <laughs> so that means you like the experience, right? You liked it. We're always talking about like it. Yeah. I love it. Oh, you love it? <laughs> of course. Oh my god. I do. Oh my god. So that means uh, you would want a repeat experience, right? Of course. See, you have my number. Anytime you need me, just give me a phone call. And even if I miss the call, I'll definitely call you back. I like the sound <laughs> of that. <laughs> but you see, El, yeah. now you are the food for the gods. Hmm? That local government headquarters <laughs> is now meant for just the gods. Eh? So don't let any other person go there. Is that understood? <laughs> yeah? Oh no. Yeah. You have just spoken in parables. Mm -hmm. But as the daughter of the soil, I understand you perfectly well. Yeah. I mean, nobody, you all have me all to yourself. Oh. Or do you think I'll ever cheat on you? Oh, that is not what I'm saying. No, you understand? I, I bet. Look, eh? that does not mean that uh, you will not have a boyfriend though, or other boyfriends. What would you say that? See, you know I, I am getting old. Eh? You need a young boy who can plan your future with you. You know, I'm not gonna marry you. See, you know, I get all the warmth and comfort that I, I need from you. So I don't need anyone else, please. Oh look, eh, the way you say these things, eh, it it mesmerizes me, you know. <laughs> no, eh? it was, uh, see, this let, let me tell you one thing. You know that I love you. I love you. You love me and you're asking me to go get a boyfriend. Don't love me. Oh, and you're just misunderstanding me. Don't worry. Don't worry. Okay? <laughs> come, come on, kiss me. Kiss me. <laughs> you too much! You this You too much! <laughs> so, no. It's about the money you promised me. Ah. Come on. Look, before you get home, you hear Bangam a lot. I trust Bangam you. a lot. <laughs> I know what you can do. All right, thank you. No it's all right. I need to start going now. Okay, okay no problem. You know, I will never disappoint you. All right, no problem. Mm -hmm. Thanks for today. All right. Then. I enjoyed myself. Ooh. All right. Ooh. I know. Yeah. Six man. <laughs> all right, bye bye. Hey.
beauté de beauté. Beauté de beauté. Look, something must kill a man. Let me refresh myself with all this young blood. This vitamin givers. Ew! Look at her. So fresh. There we go. Oh. Happen. Your father is at it again. How do you mean? Your father is seeing other women. How did you come about this information, Mama? My daughter, I was reliably informed that your father was seen at the road leading to Mazo Kando's house with a young girl. Did you follow them to confirm this information? Why? Don't you know how useless your father can be? Do I need to follow your father to confirm his escapades with Gail? Yes, Mama. Yes. You need to follow him and confirm because people are capable of sitting down, cooking up a story and throwing it at you, knowing full well that you're capable of jumping at it without any verification. So yes, you should have confirmed. The person that gave me this information can never lie to me. Mm -hmm. Yes. Really, Mama? Mm -hmm. The same way Mama Onyeka did last week, and it turned out to be nothing but lies. Wait, why does it appear as if you're supporting your father? Mama, I am not. I am not, Mama. Then what are you doing? Because judging from the way you are talking, you are supporting your father. Mama, I am not supporting Papa. How else do you want me to say it? All I am trying to do is bring your attention to the fact that the fact someone is a thief does not mean that every time something is missing, they stole it. Mama, please, before you confront Papa, go and confirm the information. Please, Mama, because I know you. If not, the first thing you will do as soon as Papa gets back is to confront him, which is not the right thing to do. You it's... know why I am happy. I am happy because you know your father is a thief. And listen, let me tell you, if he comes back here, I am going to confront him. And I'll keep doing that till he changes. Mama, Mama, listen. Mama, calm down. Mama. Confronting someone is not bad. As a matter of fact, it is good. However, that is when you must have confirmed that the person is guilty of whatever wrong you're confronting them about. Not when you're not sure. Please, come. Chelo, Atalongi. Atalongi? Wait, did you pin me? Eh? Why am I even arguing with you? Like father, like daughter. Hey, I'm on fire. Mama, Papa, Mama. Oh. Ma Mama. I don't know why people cannot even mind their business, eh? Why would somebody go and tell her that now? Mama! Mama! Good afternoon. Good afternoon, dear. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Okay. Oh, can I open it? Uh, no. Don't oh, worry. Okay. I'll open it when I feel like yeah. Thank you. Hello. Mm -hmm. Oh, look who we have here. My darling friend and my friend. Ah, I guess it's so. Good to see you. <laughs> Good to see you too. How are you? Great. Please sit down. Thank you. <laughs> I was very surprised when your line went through when I called you. And I was surprised when I saw your call. You know, I came into Nigeria three days ago. Mm -hmm. Came into the village this morning. Oh. So I actually thought you saw me somewhere. That was no. why you were calling. No. <laughs> but I was calling because there is something very important I want us to talk about. Okay? Yeah. I'm listening. Do you care for food or meat? Uh, no, no, I'm fine. You sure? 
Of course. <laughs> you shy? Hmm? Shy, okay. This is my home, so there's no way I can be shy here. Okay. I'm, I'm okay. Okay. And I will say you're glowing. Emma! Uh, you look beautiful every oh time I see God. you. Please, what is the secret? You really want to know the of secret? Of course. Let me see if I can borrow a leaf. Mm -hmm. It's Jesus. Oh <laughs> it's Lord God Almighty. <laughs> you have not. <laughs> not oh, I got you there, eh? <laughs> That girl is cheating on you. She cannot cheat on me. Yes. Okay, this is the truth and you have to embrace it. How do you explain the fact that she has not been taking your calls since morning? Maybe she left her phone. Left her phone where? Eh? Yeah? Left her phone where? She may have left her phone at home or something. For what reason? Eh? Yeah? No girl her level can leave her phone anywhere for any reason. Since morning. What makes you think so? You and I know that that phone is her office. And there is no way she would leave her office shut down since morning. Eh? Can you think now? Wake up now. Can, can we please change this topic? Can we please? Let's just change this topic. This is my problem. There's no you. problem. This is my You always like to shy away from I am not shying away from any reality for crying out loud. And you know it. What are you even saying? Huh? Okay, you have to calm down. This is reality. You have to face it. Face it and deal with it once and for all. Yeah? Look, let me tell you. I am not going to sit here with you and face any tied self-reality of yours because they are false and frame up. You're just making them up. There is no reality to face and that is the truth. Did you just say I am making all this up? Of course. You're making them up. They are false. I mean, why would you just be making up things that, 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 that does not exist? How can you be accusing my woman that she's cheating on me? What fact and evidence do you have, Okudre? Do you even know what you're saying? Okay, what do, I, what do I stand to gain in all this? What do I stand to gain in painting her black? The only reason why I'm interested in this thing is because she's a girl you want to marry. Okay, the posterity will judge me if I don't speak the truth. Okay, the, okay the, calm down. Marrying this girl is walking into a death trap. Don't say I didn't tell you. I've just realized that you don't know how much I love this girl. It has just occurred to me that you don't know how much value I place on this girl. I mean, this girl, it's my life. After my tree, she is nest. I value her with everything in me. There is no amount of frame up or makeup that you will put up here or anywhere or at any time that will make me leave her. She's the girl I love and I want to marry. Nothing should come in between me and her. Not even you, my man. I forbid you. Mukede. Mukede. How many times did I call you? You're making a mistake, oh. Okodri, the mistakes are mine. Allow me to make my mistakes and enjoy them. Okay? Don't say I didn't warn you. Don't say I did not warn you. Going ahead to marry this girl, you are going to regret it. Okay, do you will regret it if you go ahead and marry this girl. Okudri, allow me to face my problems now. Allow me to face my own problems. Are they not mine? Are they yours? Hey, it is my own problem. Allow me to face it for crying out loud. This is my own problem. Allow me to, to, to write on it and enjoy it. Hey, hey, did I make mistake by telling you that my woman wasn't picking my call? Has it become a crime? See, in fact, give me some space, please. I am beginning to think this thing is not ordinary. Mukede! She must be very stupid to think that you know who will fulfill his promise, especially buying Haika. <laughs> but why would you know renege in his promise? Oh, wait, I don't understand that question. My question is easy to understand. There's nothing to it. Not that I don't understand the actual question. All 
I'm saying is, <laughs> you and I know that you're no one who only said that to get her in his bed. Now that he has gotten his wish, why would he fulfill his promise? The only thing he will do is to find another girl to deceive. And that is it. <laughs> that is how it is. And you don't think it's wrong for him to do that? It's inhuman and I will not allow it. It's like you're interested in this matter. I am, and I intend to pursue it to a logical end. How do you intend to do that? <laughs> you know, I already have a platform where I advocate for the rights of the girl child. I will use that same platform to advocate for the rights of the side chicks. Huh? Right of the side chick? You heard me. <laughs> Wait, in a community as cultural as Akama, <laughs> I mean, this sounds very crazy to me right now. What? As crazy as it sounds, I will see to it to the end. Wait. You know that we live in a world where men are considered gods. And anything they do, they are backed by tradition. Even when the law forbids it, the custom and the tradition pats them on the back and urges them on. So the way I am seeing it, there is nothing you can achieve with this. You are not going anywhere with this. Besides, as a queen, you are supposed to uphold the morality and the uprightness of our young girls. I mean, you should be telling them that their virginity matters. You should be telling them that they should keep themselves. Now, you are saying that you want to start going after the men to compensate them for being with them. I mean, how does that sound? To me, it doesn't make any sense. She's so... Um, my dear friend. You are completely right. However, I wish to let you know that I am one woman that does not live in self-denial. We live in a new world where it is no longer realistic that our girls remain virgins until marriage. Many of our girls are now sexually active and it is the men that are responsible for it. So I would rather clamp down on these men and get them to do the needful than to involve their wives because doing that will lead to collapses of marriages and i'm not one to collapse a marriage <laughs> rights of a side chick <laughs> this is funny <laughs> I spent 10 good hours in a hotel room with a man. And he didn't give me one hour. What sort of stupidity is this? Did he just. He can't be. Maybe let me wait in the evening. If I don't see a lot, I know what to do. Beauty, what are you doing here all alone? I have a lot on my head. Where are you coming from? From your house, of course. Thank God I met you here. Why? What happened? Any problem? Not really. It's Mokedi. He has visited me today more than 10 times looking for you. Wait, I don't understand. I cannot go out again. Well, I don't think his worry is that you went out. Then what's his worry? He said he has been calling you and you weren't picking up. Uh -uh. If you call person, person, no pick. You call him back now or you call the next day. Am I with his kidney? What? Yes. We are talking about your man here. And so? Ha! I go. You see, what can you should learn to understand me? Well, that's his question to answer. But wait, what's up? Babe, I want to see Ono. Is it? Ono? Yes, now. Nah. Why are you acting as if I said an abominable thing? Ono who has a wife. I know. Oh. You know? Yes. And you are still seeing him. Moreover, he has a girlfriend. Eh? Uh -huh. Babe. Uh-uh. You know all these things now. You know why they follow all these men. Now because of money. What's that, what's that one can they do with old man like that? Uh-uh. You check me out now. Why you they talk like that? Okay. Wait. Back. What if Moke okay, finds out? Then so be it. Huh? Uh-huh. Wait. You're, you're sounding as if you don't love this guy. Like, seriously. Do you love him? Angela. You of all people should know better. You know I love him. You know I love Wokedi so much, but you should just learn to understand me. I mean, he's not a baby. 
Yeah. He shouldn't be taught everything. He needs to understand you. Yes. I think you, you should make him to understand. Like, speak to him, talk to him. I believe he will understand. See, okay, he cannot be taught everything. He's not a baby now. Uh uh, should I come and be babysitting him? You should understand all these things. I beg, I don't get time for all those ones, so. Oh, Chimo. Well, whatever you want to do, just do. All I know and all I care for is try and visit him or call him. Do anything. Just try and get to Angela, him. Angela, change topic, I beg. I don't tire. I beg. See, let's change topic. I'm tired of talking about Mokedi. I have a lot going through my head right now. He's okay. the list of my problem, I beg. No problem. But just try and see him. Because this guy has been going around this village. Angela, because of him. I am tired of this topic. In fact, I need to go home and rest. I need to sleep. If you know the kind of shares I'm coming out from now, you know the thing I'm going to do. Uh, now, what's your problem? It's your problem, Sha. So, sort yourself. Let me tell you the gospel truth, my dear friend and queen of Akama. <laughs> you are just going to waste your time and your effort in something that will not yield anything. Trust me. I mean, men with their resorts to patriarchy will never allow you bend anything. Trust me. They will not. You know, lawyers will always say that they see merit in a case before taking it up. I'm borrowing that line. I see merit in this particular issue. And that is why I have decided to pursue it relentlessly. If as a man you cannot maintain a side chick, then you have no business toasting one. They are not sex toys that you can use and dump at will whilst making bogus promises that you will end up not fulfilling just so you can have sex with them. Fantastic. Where are you? What kind of stupid question is that? Huh? You heard me correctly. I just said, where are you coming from? It's a simple question. Okay, let me ask you a simple question also. When I was leaving the house this morning, where did I tell you I was going to? You told me you were going to the palace. Exactly. So why are you asking me where I'm coming from? <laughs> Because I called the palace and they told me you were not there. Excuse me? Do you have to call the palace? Why would I not call the palace? Because you were busy running after young girls. Girls that are young enough to be your daughters. I take exception to that accusation. Mm -hmm. I mean, that is an affront, an insult to my personality. And I want you to withdraw it immediately. That is the last thing I will do or no who talk and handle. I will not do that because I am saying the truth. Which truth are you talking about? Truth by your own standard or the generally accepted truth? <laughs> huh? You are busy running after small, small girls. Are you not ashamed of yourself? Look, Mama Beatrice, I don't have time for this madness now. Allow me to go in there and get my well-deserved rest. You're going nowhere. Mama, please. I said you are going nowhere. Oh, no, we we'll talk. Shut Mama. up! Please, if you are going on. Wait. Did I hear you say 
that the great Onohu of Akama Kingdom will not be able to access his house that he built with his own money. Exactly what I meant. The great Onohu of Akama Kingdom, Onohu of Omuwa, Onohu Tokanando Omuwa, is not entering this house until you tell me where you are coming from. Beatrice. Yes, Papa. Better. No, pa Papa. Better. Go back to those smelling girls. Go. No matter what you give or no, without the side chicks, you know the rest. Jai. I think I'm very. I should get to him. Money the one child of some girl. But don't worry if I now watch it again. If I now watch it again, I saw you so. Jai. But no one said I can go. Say chicks in a book with me. I know you feel good. And make sure you have the answers to my questions. Mama, Mama, I don't like this. So I don't like it at all. You've literally just sent Papa away, and you don't know if he went back to the same place you're trying to stop him to go. No matter how aggravated you were, Mama, you should have at least allowed Papa to enter inside now. Aggravated? Gawa 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 no. No, come on, teach me English. Aggravated. Aggravated. Gawa 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 no. Like father, like daughter. Look at her. Ibe ay kuzimo yibo. Nonsense. You will still come back and meet him. Mama! Hey! What does that lady want? The one that came to let me. Oh, that one. She came to see the queen. But from all indications, she came to sell her, you know, her market. I, I don't understand. What does she sell? Uh, is I the one asking this? As if you don't know. Every one of us here understand why the woman was here now. Why are you behaving as if you just came in today? Ha, ah, no, no, they ask this kind of thing, that guy. Uh, honestly, uh, I don't know. Uh, moreover, from her appearance, she does not even look like someone who sells anything. Mm -hmm. That me confused. I okay, okay, if you don't know. If you don't know what she was here for, forget it. If I don't understand it, yeah? How far we turn she guy? Hey, now you can. Uh, my guy. Hmm? That girl, I know go lie for now. She still above my head. I, I did suffer. See, I just feel you chose the door. Believe me, oh. if not me, eh? If not me, I would not shoot this girl. Pay, pay. Oh, okay. Clean no, mouth. No, no. I would not uh -uh. shoot and clean uh -uh. mouth. My guy. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. I disagree with you. That case is not like that. I mean, this case is so preserved. You, you guys are giving this girl the power and respect she doesn't deserve. I know you like her. The truth is that it's only both of us now that have sense in this place. Hmm? Um, 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 if, you, if you don't know, if you don't know how to go about it, if you don't understand how to talk to a woman, you can just come now, come to us. In fact, Ozemina, teach him how to get that girl. You, Ozemina, teach him. Mr. Coach, big player. Oyana. Okay, if you need the code for things like this, you come, you pay me, everything will be settled. No. I don't need any useless code, I beg. Thank you. Don't worry. Uh, uh, with time, uh, you don't need everything it. will, will work out. Uh, 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 it's I okay, I understand you. Time. I know you will be preparing. Hmm? Yes. Continue to be preparing. On the other guy. On the other guy. swear the woman. It's a lie. It's not like that. Oh, no, it can never happen. Keep preparing now. Also, I'm going to tell you the woman. Why does he appear as if you don't want to tell me what transpired between you and the Queen? How did he go? Well, I feel everything is going on well. The Queen listened to me. She even offered to entertain me, but I declined. I wasn't there for that. Nice. What about the complaint? Of course, she promised to do something about it. I mean, I still can't believe that the Queen listened to you. She didn't cut cross like someone who would pay attention to anyone that walks into the palace without invitation or appointment with her. Well, maybe it's one of those notions people have about people. Before they get to know them, she halted the stupid guard that was embarrassing me. And then she listened to me. Wow, I'm impressed. 
I'm impressed that the coin is not what they painted her to be. Not at all. The woman I met today is a nice person. She showed concern. Wow. This is impressive. What about Casey? How is he? Mm, my Casey. Casey is fine. He will be visiting next week. But I hope he's not going to find out what is going on between you and Ono. How would he find out? Or are you planning to tell him? Don't be ridiculous. How could you say a thing like that? Just joking. <laughs> Better. Greetings, Your Majesty. Greetings. We are know. Your Majesty. Welcome. Sit down. Thank you. Your voice didn't sound well on the phone. What is the problem again? Your Majesty, I know who talk and is at it again. What is it this time around? Your Majesty, I want you to help me ask my husband. Talk to him. Ask him what he saw in small girls that he's running after. I cannot ask him such question. But all the same, if you have anything to discuss with me, go ahead and talk. I'm all ears. Your Majesty, my husband has started running after small girls again. You know what this kingdom? Do you have any proof to that? Your Majesty, I was reliably informed that he was seen in his car with a small girl. And you think it's enough for you to conclude that he's having an affair outside? Eh? The young girl in question may be a lady of Akama Kingdom that he wants to help. Your Majesty, I can bet with my life that the lady in question is my husband's side chick. And how did you know she is a side chick? Your Majesty, do not defend my husband, for you do not know him too well. I am not trying to defend anybody. I'm only reacting from what you've just said. In as much as you want to protect your family and your husband, you need to censor every information you receive so they do not accuse him wrongly. Your Majesty, the person who gave me this information was so sure. You are educated. Be careful and verify before you accuse him wrongly. Your Majesty, please, I want you to talk to my husband. He is the man I married. I know him too well. And I know when he starts his nonsense. You are talking about the law of this kingdom. Do you have any proof to that effect? He came by, but that wasn't enough reason for you to not have picked my call now. Uh, really? Yes. What okay. can Check it now. It wasn't enough reason. I was calling and calling and calling. And calling. You didn't pick my call. You know what? I guess I wasted my time coming here to see hey. you. Hey! Please let me be. Kim? Hey. Leave me. Ma'am, I'm sorry now. I'm sorry. Just that I was worried. I was missing the love of my life. I had to be calling and calling and calling. You didn't pick. Wait, are you suggesting that I'm cheating on you or what? Because I don't understand. You know, I, 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 it's not what I mean. Oh, I didn't say that. You didn't say it, but you're implying it. Baby, don't see it like that please. now, please. Don't see it that way. It's not what I mean. I, I was only worried that something may have happened to the love of my life. If anything happened to you now, don't you know I, I would die? Hey, what would I do without you? I can't live without you, please. I was worried. Hmm? It's okay, I've heard you, please. I'm sorry, yeah. Apology accepted. Sorry. It's mine for me now. My queen. I want to ask you for something. Yeah. What is it? See, I want you to trust me. I will never cheat on you. Just believe me now, please. 
Ubima, I, I trust you. And I know you can't cheat on me. I know I, I was only worried that something bad may have happened to you. That was why. That was mm. my concern. Nothing is going to happen to me. I'm here and I'm here for you. Hey, so don't worry, I'm thank good. You so much. Hmm? Stop getting worried. I love you so much. You're you such a big it. baby star. <laughs> My baby, you know, I can't do anything without you I now. Know. I know. You. you mean so much to me. I love you too. I love you with all my I heart. In too. fact, Hubim, huh? hey, I've missed you so much. I missed you more. Guess, guess what? What? Just, just make a case now. Just make a case. Mm. Let me see. You made my favorite. Hey! Am I right? How did you know? Oh, thank you. That's the first thing of you. <laughs> Do you see that? Thank my you heart so and your heart is like, what? I cannot wait. Today I love your food. Hey, see how you just gave what was in my heart. <laughs> Dude, this food is so delicious. Really? Yeah, but <laughs> you know you, you didn't really have to disturb yourself preparing this for me. What do you mean? Hmm? You spoil it when you say disturb. I did it with all pleasure. Thank you very much. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> By the way, where's your spoon? I don't need a spoon because the meal is for you alone. Come on, babe. You know I cannot finish this. Well, eat what you can. I'm not going to eat all I can. I, I'm going to feed you from this. No. You're going to eat I'm okay. No, 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 I'm good. We have, we have to share. I think my father is back. Oh, okay. Let me get the gifts, please. Right. I'll be right back. That greetings to yourself. The question here is, who are you? Wait, Papa, I just told you he's my friend. Keep quiet! Keep quiet this minute! Stay out of this! Young man, leave my compound this minute. Papa, he just came to see you and you... I said keep quiet! One more way from you, and you will see the other side of me. Young man, I say out! Papa, please. I mean, why are you treating my friend like a nobody? As far as I am concerned, he is a nobody. And I don't want to see him and eat near my precious daughter. Papa. Now out! Papa, that is a, that's a wrong way to judge him. Please, Papa. My friend, five seconds, or you will be you will regret being born. Out! Idiot! As I get out! Oh. And where do you think you're going? Come on, get back here! Idiot! Get back! Papa, why are you doing this to me now? Get inside! Papa, what is this now? Beauty, you said you wanted to have a discussion with me. Yes. I'm here now, so go ahead and talk. I didn't see the money you promised to wire into my account. Oh, oh, oh. My bad. I don't know, maybe it's old age. I completely forgot. But why didn't you remind me? Wait, 
I should remind you for something you promised me. How can you even say that to me? Should you, should you be reminded? It's all right. Don't worry. I, before the end of today, you will get an alert, okay? Oh no, we sis, you don't even understand. You are going to send that money right here and now. Beauty? Yes. What do you mean by I'm sending that money right here and now? What, what, what's the meaning of that force? You heard me. We had an agreement. And I've kept my own back part of the bargain. And you have to keep to yours. And you're doing it right here and now. Or you want, you want me to force you? Oh. Yes. You want to force me? Yes, I will. Okay. Go ahead and force me. I should go ahead and force you. Mm -hmm. Really? I should go ahead and force you. God, beauty, you're, you're joking, right? Does this face look like one who is joking? Like, do I really look like a joke to you? Do I look like a joke to you? Have you forgotten that you are talking to the only world of this great kingdom? Which eh? so... You are talking to me with force like that. But if you get out of my car, I have an important engagement. Come and push me. I am not leaving this car until you send that money. I will not leave here. You must send that money into my account. And right now. Oh, you want to see what I can do? You really want to see what I can do, ba? Oh no. You want to try me? Greetings, Your Majesty. You sent for me. I'll say my name. Your Majesty. How are you? I'm fine. I have been calling the Ono and his number is not connecting. Can you please hurry to his place and let him know that I'm summoning him before me? Your Majesty, he just got off the phone with the king and he's already on his way to the palace. He is? Yes, my queen. Who is he coming to see? His Majesty the King. Very well then. Do let him know that when he is done discussing with the king, I would like to see him also. I will do that, my queen. You may leave now. Okay. Let it not be that this girl has carried this matter to the king. I will not be happy to hear that. Beauty, I don't want to use force on you. But if you force me to, if you don't get out of this car this minute, I will. Please feel free to use force on me. But before then, I will call your wife to come see things herself. Beauty! Feel free, yes. You dare not. Try using force on me then. Oh mm -hmm. no. Try it. But Beauty, why are you doing this? Eh? Why? You cost it. I mean, men like you are the type that like using young girls. And at the end of the day, you won't keep to the uh, uh, end of the bargain. Ah, Beauty, but I told you, I will pay. Then prove it. Prove it by sending the money into my account. What is there? Send the money to my account. In fact, from the look of things, eh, I'm not sure this relationship will continue. Honestly. Same here. Same here because I, I, I can't deal with a stingy man. Ah, uh, that is where you get me wrong. I am not stingy. I'm very generous. Anyway, let me not talk. I don't need to blow my own trumpet. You're not generous anything. See, send the money to my account. Prove it. Prove me wrong. See, this one you are barking like a wounded dog. How much am I even owing you? I'm not owing. How much did I promise you? Because I'm not owing you. It's 50,000 naira you promised me. So send it to me. Beauty? Yes. So it's because of ordinary 50,000 naira that you want to pull that heaven, carry heaven, or bring it to the earth. Wait, you call it ordinary, and yet you cannot send the money to me. Since it's ordinary, I send it to my account now. What's the big deal? <laughs> beauty, beauty. Please. Beauty, 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 beauty. <laughs> look at me. Look, at, once you are angry, eh, your beauty begins to radiate. You know, ah, that is when I even love you the more. Yeah, Please get, don't get angry me. now. Get angry. Don't patronize me. See, you really got me upset. I'm really angry with you. Okay, wait. 
Let me have your account number. Wait. That means you didn't even save the account number the last time, as you promised. Give me the account number already. If I as we speak, I'm already in your bank. That means you didn't even have plan to even send the money to me. Huh? Give me the number. 50-810-11581. Bangam, go and check your account balance. <laughs> it's there. I won't put extra. I've seen the money. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I need to start going now. Are, are you not forgetting something? What is that? Oh, come on. Give daddy a kiss. Come on. Give yeah, daddy a no, kiss. You feel like good thing, but if, if it's to bring money, you'll not bring money. Come on. Mm. Ah! You eh? <laughs> Come, come and see this for yourself. We have to leave, leave that thing you're eating. See what? Did you see a spirit? What should I come and see? Follow me, let's go. How do you expect me to follow you to somewhere that I don't even know? Would you tell me where I'm following you to? Okay, I just saw your girlfriend, Beauty, kissing another man in the sky. Follow me, let's go and see. I thought you even have something important to talk about, eh? You've gone to smoke that thing you smoke. Someone saw you running, bah, 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 bah. see who you saw his. Nah, okay. Did you go and smoke that thing you used to smoke? Wait, is it, is it that you don't believe me or what? Why would I believe you? Believe you for what? Look, if this is what you have come here to discuss this afternoon, okay, I'm not interested. This is my problem with you. Eh? This is my problem with you. You trust this girl too much. You have so much trust for her. Come and say something. You are, you are, you are here doubting me. Come and eat. See. Hey, for you to be able to marry, a woman, hmm? you must learn to trust them. But that is if the woman is worthy of being trusted. That's if she can be trusted. My own can be trusted, and I trust her. To prove that to you now, just follow me and come and see. Keep this thing you're eating. Come and follow me. Let's go. And if I follow you to that place and end up finding out that it's not my woman that you saw, what do you want me to do to your wedding? Set money. No, take a bet. Now, how much do you want to set? If I will not eat your money this afternoon, let's take a bet. What the quite serious? Oko the mabas, if I leave this food now that I want to eat and satisfy my hunger and follow you that place and find out that it's not my woman that you saw there. Yem game make it, eh? Okay, let's go. Yeah? Come on, food, let's go. I, I will not bet money with you. I, I just want to follow and prove to you that it's not my girl that you saw. Let me drink out Nari water. You don't have this time now. Don't beat it. Let's go. You don't me, let's you go. Let me drink. Yeah? Okay. Follow my friend, follow me. Wait, let me take my food inside. Only Yan and Dirobi. Oh, they're HLD and Okay, don't touch food. I am Why do you want to see me? I should have a greeting first before this question, don't bros, you think? Bros, I don't have time for courtesy at all. So if you know what you want to say, say it. It's like someone got you upset before coming out to see me. That should be the least of your problems. Can you start talking? Well, what I want to say to you is like a seed. And your character is a soil. Hence it cannot germinate. I can see you really do not have any reason calling me out here. I do. No, you don't. You don't, because if you do, you would have started talking already. Can we go somewhere and talk? No. This is a very appropriate place for us to talk. Why are you this host tight, me? Listen, you have just 10 seconds to start talking, easy. or I'll walk out of here. Come on, easy. Five seconds left. I said she's from your woman. And you your see... time is up. Let it be on record that you called me out here to waste my time. Excuse me? What is wrong with you? God. 
Damn it. What kind of a person is this? Exactly what I saw there. Eh? The, the vehicle was parked here, just like this. Hey, hey, now see the legs. See the, hey, see the legs of the tire. See, see you see? The vehicle was parked here. The, the, the man was here. Hey, man, man, oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your girlfriend, Beauty, was here. And they were kissing. Kissing and frolicking here. So, where are they? Yeah. Where are they now, Okodre? They were here moments ago now. They were here. So this is why you came and made me to leave the food that I was eating. I was so hungry, I wanted to satisfy my hunger. You just made me to abandon my food in the middle of nothing, only to come and witness your mere imagination. Why would you call it imagination now, eh? Why would you say, my problem is why do you not always believe? Whatever thing that concerns this game, you don't believe it. Tell yes, say. Yes, didn't I believe you? I believed it, that's why I left the food at home and followed you. I'm following you only to come here and observe your, your hallucination and nothing but hallucination. Stop it, stop it! I will not take that nonsense from you. Which one is hallucination? Can't you take back that word? What kind of nonsense is that? Uh, am I mad? Am I, am I, am I, do I drink carelessly? Or do I, is there something I smoke? Am why I, would you call it hallucination? Is it sure that you're not smoking? My friend, stop listening. I, I, I said I saw them. Eh? These are the legs of the vehicle. Are you not seeing these legs of the vehicle? The vehicle was parked here. The man here, your woman here. Eh, eh, See eh, see eh. I, I guess we should just walk down the road. I'm sure they might have gone it off those ways. I Let's just walk down the road and see if we see. I run up again. Eh? Walk down where? You and who? Which one is me? You are who? Me and you now? Nah? Me and you? Eh? Uh -huh. if, if you were not my good friend, eh, I would have found one stone here and just and I help this your two legs. You're looking for work, ba? Just go and look for one farm there and help them and be farming. Don't don't come and stress my life, oh. Which one is uh, bringing somebody out to come and see ghosts that you saw? I told you, you're not going to see something. Oh, we're here now, Baginisi. You didn't see me. Tell the people that sent you that you didn't see me. I don't know. Okay, are you suggesting that, that they have become so, 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 so jobless and, and that they have too much free time to be walking around to look for hey, stories to tell? Eh? Eh, 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 see, is this not, not, eh, eh, eh? Where are you going? I'm coming. This boy, eh? Hello. Majesty. Your wife was here yesterday. She came here. What did she come to do? She came to register her displeasure over the way you move around small, small girls in this kingdom. You know, is that the truth? Well, Your Majesty, you know. Hmm? In as much as uh, what she's saying is true, that woman, that Mama Beatrice, is only looking for trouble. I don't think so. I don't think she's looking for trouble. She's only trying to guard, protect what actually belongs to her from these small, small girls. <laughs> Your Majesty, forget about her. Eh? Did she tell you she lacks anything? Uh, she didn't say anything like that. <laughs> Nothing like that. Your Majesty, Look, forget about this woman. Eh? If I tell you how I spend on this woman, now let me tell you, I want to bust your bubble. Do you know I give her a whooping 200,000 every month for her upkeep? Aside the fact that I'm the one that pays all the bills. Eh? Then on top of that, I buy food stuff. Each time I travel, I buy bush meat, plantain, yams, everything. So what, what's her problem? Is she lacking anything? Oh no, this thing you're talking about is not her worry at all. It's not her trouble. Her worry is what these uh, small, small girls do with her husband outside there. That is the only thing disturbing her. Look, Your Majesty, hmm. don't allow anything about my wife come between us. Eh? I want to enjoy my life. She's trying to frustrate me and I will not allow it. Ah. No, but judge it by yourself. Your family is your first priority. They come first. No. Well, I know, Your Majesty, I know. I know that my family comes first. And I am very good at that. My, my family is okay. Huh? 
you know something or no? I would rather advise that you deal with these girls more of indoors than outdoors. Yes, that way you will dance their curiosity. Honestly. <laughs> Your Majesty, <laughs> that is the expert talking. Who am I not to obey the advice? At least you advice. so that you don't spoil this for Yes, us. I will. <laughs> Baby. Baby! 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 Where did you go to? I thought I told him I was coming to see you. Did you come now? That shouldn't be the question. The question should have been where are you coming from? Even after I told you I was coming to spend time with you. I'm sorry. See, my friend here and I, we went somewhere to go and check something. Check, 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 check what? We went to confirm who that man is. The man I saw you with in the car. You keep kissing and fumbling with. Excuse you? Put the My friend, put to her, put to her. Come down, let me handle this. Who cared? Baby. You brought me out here to be insulted. No, it's not what you think, my love. It's not what you think. Wait, if I should understand this. He stupidly came here to tell you that he saw me kissing a man in his car. And you stupidly followed him to go confirm, right? You went to go catch me red and dead. It's a lie. It's, not, it's a different thing, you know. There is a I'm of disappointed it. at you. I'm very much disappointed baby, at that. Baby, please now. We can Let sort me this go. Thing. Baby, we can sort this thing out. You don't just have to be angry like that now. You know I love you. Eh? I'm freaking out. We can't sort anything out. Baby, baby, please now. Don't just leave me. Baby, I'm working. You see what you've cost now? Have you seen? What do you just cost now? If you know what is good for you, follow this girl and go and bring her back here now. And now, if not, I'm going to vent my anger on you. My bassy! hasn't gotten to that. Don't tell me to come down. Come, I told you to follow you can go and bring her back. You want to enter inside. What the can I him now? Listen. Hey, give me key. Let me open this door and enter inside. It has gotten to that and that is exactly where we are now. You're not entering anywhere. Follow her and go and bring her back. That girl is my life. Without her, I can't leave. Come bring her back for me. Give me key. Let me open door and enter the house now. Give you which key. Go and bring the girl back for me. Eh? Yeah, that's what you want. Eh? It's your house. It's the house, oh. I have my own house. Fake, fake time prior. I don't know if it's ghost you saw. You come and tell me here that you saw my girl with who. Next time you you be careful or, or how to spread false news about people. Anon Pam. Greetings, my queen. Greetings, Ono. Please oh, sit. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you, my queen. Do you care for anything? Ah, uh, no. I'm fine. I'll be brief and straight to the point so that you can attend to other things that you have to attend to. I will appreciate that, my queen. A young lady who goes by the name Ivy came to me and complained that you promised her a car and up until this moment as we speak, she has not received that car promise. Ivy. Oh, my queen. Please, forget about that girl. Why should I? Did you promise her a car? Yes, I did. But I didn't mean it. I mean, why should I buy her a car? Is her local government headquarters made of gold? Responsible men do not make promises that they do not intend to fulfill, don't you think? My queen, are you by any means insinuating that I'm not a responsible man? I'm saying that you should do the needful. Your word should be your bond or no. You should buy her that car. Um, 
Please, my queen, don't involve yourself in this matter. I mean, why should I buy a car for a side chick? Because you promised. I know how much you and the elders in council make from the Akama timber market. Buy her a car. I don't understand, my queen. Are you going to force me to buy the car? You will buy her a car. That is the beginning and the end of the conversation. Well, it's all right, uh, my queen, I've heard you. Is there any other thing you want to discuss with me? Nothing at all. In that case, I'd better take my leave. By all means, proceed. You are courageous. Evil men fears you. You are courageous. Evil men fears you. Baby. Are you avoiding me? I've been calling you for the past couple of days. Why are you not picking my calls? There was no need picking your calls. And that's why I've not been taking them. Baby. Don't tell me you're so angry with me because of that incident that happened between you and my father when you came to our house. Of course I am angry. As a matter of fact, being angry is an understatement. I am very much irritated. I'm sorry. It's oh. not about being sorry. Eh? It's not about being sorry. What did I ever do to your father to make him treat me that way? Baby, you know this is a road. We cannot be having such a conversation here. Why don't we go to your place? Let's it's go not, to your place and talk about it. There's nothing to talk about. What do you mean? Did you not see the way your father treated me that day? Eh? That, that was even the first time he was meeting me. Did I ever do, do anything wrong to him? Baby, I said I'm sorry now. Why are you so angry? That no. is in the past. We plan getting married, right? Of course. Then how do you think our marriage can hold if your father does not like me? Baby, don't worry. I'm going to make my father like you. You can take my word. That's why I'm pleading with you to be calm. You know, my, my father's behavior the other day was very much unlike him. I believe someone might have gotten him angry on his way back home. Are you sure? Mm -hmm. I can't really say for sure though, but chances could be that someone got him upset. Because he's not always like that. He's a nice man and you find out with time. So, are you giving me your words that you're going to talk to him into liking me? For the maybe tenth time, even though I know I'm exaggerating, <laughs> I'm going to make him like it. I promise. For sure. Come on. I promise. So, can we now go to your place and talk? Why not? Yes. Look at you. You wanted me to come with you. <laughs> you know I Hi, you. <laughs> You never miss a chance. Let's, 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 but you were you, you were you were doing shakara. Of course no. Of course no. Oh my god. Yes, get away. Come in, Zoom. Your Highness, it is. Alpha. The coast is clear. The coast is clear. Yes, Your Majesty. You see, I can count on you always. That's good. Always, Your Majesty. Good. I hope nobody followed you. No, 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 no. Not at all. Uh, it's alright. Get the car ready. In 20 minutes time, we shall move. All right, Your Majesty. Good. Uh, Ozemina, come. Come. Your Majesty. Please. On no account should anyone hear about this. Did you get that? Yes, Your Majesty. My King, I know what is involved here. As well as the implications. Good. Good boy. 20 minutes time then. Just right. get a carriage. I'll be with you, Your Majesty. Ozeman, Onyan, Hazi. The most
So this guy is not coming again today. Huh? You requested to see me. I am here. Yes. I told you something the other time. You said you were going to get back to me. Up till now you have not said anything. What is it? Remind me. I told you that I love you. And I want you to be my girlfriend. It is not going to be possible. Why? Because I love you. Why? I love you. <laughs> so I cannot be your girlfriend. Come on, uh, Chica. It sounds crazy. Uh, you love me, yet you don't want to be my girlfriend. <laughs> Come on, what an irony. As crazy as it may sound, I love you. And I cannot be your girlfriend. Uh, uh, Chica, um, I know you are joking. Eh? Keep joke aside and face reality. Yes. It sounds like a joke. But I cannot be your girlfriend because I love you. Chica, please give me a chance. I promise to love and cherish you. Please. You really need to know when to stop. Even if you lie down on the floor, cry out blood from your eyes, there is nothing you or I can do about it. My love, please, is there anything I need to do for you to accept me? Absolutely nothing. I am doing this for the safety of your soul. What do you mean? I do not have time to explain things to you. Maybe when I do, I will let you know in details. For the safety of my soul. I am super happy. My, my woman just left here hey. after making me happy. <laughs> You've seen how happy and excited you are I'm after making you. out with your woman. And you are busy with hunting my own woman. No, no. You don't call that witch hunting now. Huh? Don't call it witch hunting. I come yeah? like a jar, eh? Oh, <laughs> things fall apart. <laughs> hey, leave that one for another day. By the way, you said there is something you wanted to tell me about the father of your girl. Ah, uh, yes. There was something I wanted to talk about. You know, uh, it has been overtaken by events. Overtaken <laughs> by which event? <laughs> Caterpillar or truck? <laughs> okay, tell me what happened. Give him an... Yes, yes. Hey, that, oh, give him an azun ka o. Hey, what thing I wanted to talk about is... Hmm. My brother, you needed to have seen the way... My girlfriend's father humiliated me the day I went to see my girl. Ah, the embarrassment was not here. The man the embarrassed, the, 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 the hell out of me. Makage, the person sinike. What happened? Do I know? Do I know? And what did you do? What could I have done? I had to just leave the place. Honestly, I was embarrassed. I was humiliated by that man. Oh, oh yes. So yeah. since the father of the girl that you wish to marry does not love you, what do you intend to do? Uh, I don't know. At first, I was very worried. You know, I was devastated to, 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 to say, but... Okay. My woman has uh, assured me that she's going to talk to her father into accepting me. Hey. So, um, so she can actually do that? Yeah, she assured me that she will. But then uh, there is no cause for alarm now. Who can go now? Casey here now, what do you for? 
But what has been bothering me is why did he treat me the way he treated me? Like that was the first time we were ever meeting. So why did so why that much hatred? Hey, hey, my man, don't disturb your brain looking for answer or cracking your head because of You know, the reason for his actions is not far fetched. That man thinks that every other man is like him. How do you mean? Is it that you've not had a woman that is busy gallivanting with uncountable side chicks? He has so many side chicks around him now. If you see where they are moving, it looks like a bendy mozin and then they say, That old man. <laughs> I even heard that he doesn't give shishi. Yeah? I did, I shishi. <laughs> that means there must be something else he's using to hold the girl, so. Perhaps, perhaps, you understand. So, that is what is happening to you here. Hi. Uh, but since your woman has come promised, and sit down, let me. I need to watch this one. Because you want to you come and sit down. I don't down, know what down. is at the back of the level. Mama! Yo, yeah, baby. I went to see Uncle Dilly. Oh, how is he doing? He's doing fine, Mama. What happened to him? Papa happened to him. I don't understand. Mama, Uncle Dilly came here the other day and Papa abused the life out of him and asked him out. Why? He never stated his reasons. No, your father cannot do that. Mama, why would I lie against Papa? I have no reason to do that. As a matter of fact, I was very surprised. Wait a minute. Is your father aware that Okodiri wants to marry you? Not yet, because he did not even give him the chance to make known his intentions, which was one of the reasons he came. You see the problem with your father? Any man he sees around you, he believes that the man wants to exploit you and get away, because that's what he does. Which is a misjudgment of character, Mama. Because I have known Okudili for over two years. He's not the type to exploit my body and walk away. Now, let me tell you. Your father's attitude towards any man that comes around you might hinder you from getting married. God forbid. God forbid, Mama. I am not going to allow Papa ruin my relationship with Okudili. I will not allow that to happen. Come to think of it, Mama, this is the same reason Smart left me. Do you remember? Are you telling me? I know. Mama. Let's go and cook. What are you preparing? I want to make a red oil to love fresh. I hope you have done the spice, though, because every time now, you'll just be waiting for me to do everything. So, you want me to do it for you? Mama, now. Hey, if you cook for me today, something happen. See, you already happen. want me to go and do this thing. Ivy, your cheap blackmail of going to report me to the Queen will not work. Trust me. You call it a blackmail? What else is it? Huh? What else? But what I can guarantee you is that you will fail. Oh no. You don't know who you are dealing with. Obviously. Who are you? Look at this girl. Who are you? Look, you are a daughter of nobody, let me tell you. You are a daughter of nobody. Come, were you really thinking that I will buy you a car? <laughs> huh? Oh no, I don't, honestly, I don't care. Whatever it is you planned, is none of my business. All I know is, so long as you promised to buy me a car, you must, I mean must, buy me that car. <laughs> let that sink into your head. <laughs> oh, you see? I just laugh anytime you you talk threateningly. I, I laugh. What can you do? I must look at you. <laughs> oh no, a laugh is is free, so you can laugh as much as you want. I don't care. So keep laughing. Mm. Yeah. Now, let me ask you a question. You small girl, like this. You are asking for a car. Can your father afford the wheel of a bicycle? <laughs> oh no. You can insult me. No problem. I'm going to take it. But you see, insulting my dad mm. is one thing I will not take from you. Oh really? What will you do? 
No, no, no. If I, if I insult your father, what will you do? And I'm asking that question again. Can your father afford the wheel of a bicycle? You must be very stupid eh? for saying that. You heard me. Evie, what did you just call me? Stupid? Life and the rest. In fact, you are the you are the most useless titled man I've ever seen in my whole life. Anyway, you will go scot free on this because um, today is my good. I have I'm in a good mood today, so I won't take offense on this. Okay. <laughs> Is your business well um you will hear from me mm -hmm. no you will hear from me get out of my car oh god get out i'm yeah. always ready for you listen yeah. let me tell you i'm ready for you i'm ready anyhow you want it i'll give it to you uh -huh. nonsense I've read, get out you poor church rat nonsense. your father cannot afford she I she you are here asking for a car idiot your father has no shishi, shishi. You're asking for a car. Simply because you gave me what? Eh? Your local government headquarters, is it made of gold? Asking for a car, idiot. Just because I just want to use it. Do you know how many of these young chicks I, I, I deal with in a day? Idiot. If I give you 10,000 naira, won't you, you, you won't even you know, praise me for it. You won't thank me. Asking for a car, idiot. Hi, I so far. Right off, oh, mama, she said. It does say it whether you like a man or two. You must bear. Right off, oh, mama, she said. It does say it whether you like a man or two. You must bear. You sound as if it's so bad. Is it about the law? <sighs> Women are suffering in this kingdom. Why do you say so? You will not believe what the Onowo had to say to me when he heard about the girl's claims. What did he say? He said, I should forget about that girl. <laughs> Is he that arrogant? Mm -hmm. I don't know him to be an arrogant man, but his response sure portrays him as an arrogant man in reality. <laughs> Men and their bloated egos. I mean, maybe because a woman is involved, he decided to be arrogant. You know how they are. Oh, then he should be prepared for what is to come. Because chances are he might not be able to stand it. You know, a lot of women in this town, not just this town, everywhere, suffer the same thing. These men use them and dump them at the end. They are helpless because they really do not know who to talk to, who to confide in, or who will speak for them. It's insane. It's really insane. Indeed. Now this is the reason I wanted you to be in on this with me. I knew you'd see reasons. I knew you'd see that we have a case to make. Mm. One question I want to ask is this. Will the king support you? Oh, please. I don't need his support. What I'm doing is my way of giving back to the women folk. And I will push this narrative even with the drop of my blood. I love your determination. But I just want to beg you one thing. What is it? Don't pull out when the heat is on. You sound as if you don't know me anymore. Whatever project I embark on, I relentlessly pursue till the aims and objectives for which I started are achieved. You can take that to the bank. I'm never backing down. Well, in that case, I assure you, I'm in on this with you <laughs> to the end. Thank you. It's okay. Baby girl. Hey, babe, what's up? I'm okay. Hey, how are you doing? I'm fine. <laughs> what's up now? What kept you for so long? 
My dear, the discussion turns into a heated argument. How? The fool is insisting on not buying me the car. Ivy, to me, I would suggest you forget about the car. Forget about him buying a car for you. Do you know who I know, based on what we have heard about him, we never buy you a car. Despite him being the second in command in Akama Kingdom, he hasn't even bought a car for his own wife. The poor lady is using one of his cars. So please, forget about it. <laughs> She's the one allowing him to play dumb with her. And honestly, it is not my business. It should be your business because you need to know the kind of man you're dealing with. I don't care what manner of man he is. So long as he promised to buy me a car, he must buy me that car. I mean, must. The earlier you stopped deceiving yourself that he will buy a car for you, the better. Did I hear you just say I am deceiving myself? Yes. I'm sorry it sounds harsh, but it's what it is. I don't want to say much. Let's bet on this. He must buy me that car. <laughs> Can we bet? Ivy, I go chop you. I got marry a gogi. <laughs> what are you saying? Why, what is the need of betting with you when I know I will win you? He will never buy that car for you. Mm -hmm. Read my lips. You don't know me for that. Let's just take it. Let's take it. What do you need of making a strike that I know I'm win? <clears throat> Papa, he called me. Sit. Oh, <clears throat> uh, Beatrice. Papa. I'm going to go straight to the point, and I will be very, very unambiguous in what I'm going to say. Okay? okay you see that young man. Whatever is going on between two of you, stop it immediately. Is that understood? But why, Papa? Shut up, I'm still talking. Then you ask me questions. She has every right to air her opinion no matter that concerns her. So don't tell her to shut up, no. Hey, quiet there, woman. Who, who, who asked you to, to join this discussion? You, you came in the first time. I actually wanted to send you back, but I just left you. Now you are going beyond your boundaries. I don't need to be invited before I could involve myself in a matter that has to do with my daughter. Kenny. Anyway, I, I don't have your time. I don't have your time right now. Uh, Beatrice. Papa. Like I said, end whatever you have in common with that young man. Never. Come, are you deaf? No. Eh? Are you Pat Johnson? You must comment on everything. I said you are not invited. If you know what is good for you, keep quiet. But Papa, there has to be a reason why you don't like this young man. Don't you think I deserve to know this reason? I am your father. I know what is good for you. So, the, the reason for what I am saying is best known to me. Well, All I am asking is just leave him alone. Well, is that too much to ask? Yes, Papa. It is too much to ask. It is too much to ask because one, I don't know your reason. Two, I love him and he loves me, Papa. So then I cannot leave him. <laughs> God! Ne. Let's go and continue. Thank you. With the oh, cooking. No, no. Are, are you challenging me? No, no. Are you challenging me? I know we'll talk and handle. Call it whatever you like. All I'm saying is that you are not going to marry my daughter. Egania. Yeah. Yeah. This is what you have to say. Look, if it's a gang up here, it will not stand in this house. It will not stand! It's alright. <laughs> what is it? I am tired. But I need you. Can we discuss this in the morning, please? I'm tired, honestly. You realize this is the third week in a row you're resisting me. Oh, can we just have this discussion in the morning, no. please? No, no. 
No, no, no. Let's have the discussion right now. Why? I don't know. It's you who should be doing the talking. What is going on? Like what? You tell me. Why are you resisting me? I don't think I have time for this. Like I said, let's have this, this discussion till morning. You I'm tired. Do you realize that we still do not have any children? I've told you time and time now, but stop reminding me of this. I am not God that gives children. Please, let me be. Well, I have to remind you because if we continue like this with what you're doing, chances are we will end up childless. And the implication of it is that royalty will probably or most definitely move away from your lineage. I don't think I have time for unnecessary argument now. Please, I just want to have my rest. Where are you going? Please, let me be. They have suddenly changed. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Please, I'm looking for the new clinic. Oh, okay. You've passed it, actually. You see the road over there? Yes. Yeah, just take it. When you get there, take your left. The building you see is the clinic. Okay, I should move down the road, the first entrance by my left. Right. Young man. What were you discussing with my daughter? Papa! Shut up! Am I asking you? I ask you again! What were you doing with my daughter? Hi. Nothing! Liar! You are lying! You think I didn't know? You are trying to ask her to, to come and visit you in your house? My That's God. not true! I was only asking for a direction! Exactly! You were asking for direction at the same time giving her direction to, to, to your house! Hi. I don't like this old man! Why are you embarrassing me? Oh! Thank God you know I'm an old man. And if I lay a curse on you, that curse will stick with you forever. Papa! 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 Papa, please. Papa! Why? Why, Papa? Why are you always embarrassing me? For crying out loud, this young man was asking me the clinic, the new clinic over there. And that was the direction I was giving to him before you came. Why are you doing this to me? Now, if you don't keep quiet, eh? If you don't keep quiet, you will regret the day you were born. So better keep quiet. Let me finish with this stupid man. Man, you, you, you listen to me. This girl is my precious daughter. And if you stay close to her again, if you don't stay away from her, eh? Oh God, you will regret it. In fact, I will so do with you. You will have me to contend with. Idiot, now get her from me. I don't have your time. Eh? I will advise you to respect your old age. Look at that. You are pointing your fingers at me. You want me to slap you, idiot? Did you hear him? Of course I heard him. And you brought it upon yourself. Papa, if you continue like this, you will attract more insults from people even younger than him. What is it? Are you the only one that has a daughter? Eh? You're talking to me. Hey, Papa, daughter. leave me. Get down. I'm begging. What is it? Are you the only one that has a daughter? Eh? Are you? Somebody cannot even have peace. Oh, so you're insulting me? I am not insulting you. You're insulting yourself, Papa. It is your father that is insulting himself. Who is oh, my father? So I'm the father. Oh. It is your mother that is insulting herself. Idiot. Can you imagine? It's all right. You will hear from me. You will hear from me. Hello, Ivy. <laughs> My queen. Greetings, my Greetings. Queen. Sit, please. Thank you, my queen. My queen, I came to find out how it's going with your noble. Oh. The man is proving tough, but we will humble him. I can't wait for that to happen. It will happen soon. Okay, my queen. 
Can I ask if there are any other girls that you know currently going through the same situation as you? Mm, yeah, about five of them. Yeah. That's a reasonable number. Do you think you can assemble them all here before me at the palace for an interactive section? Very possible, my friend. Good. Of course. So how soon can we make that possible? It all depends on you, my queen. So, it's all about you. <laughs> I work from home. So anytime you people choose to visit the palace so that we can talk, I'll always be here. Okay, my queen. Okay, my queen. Uh, I think what we are going to do is this. I will go and tell them about the meeting. Then I will get back to you about whatever they say. That's a good one. Thank you. Listen to this. I want you to keep our meetings and our discussions really private. It is a secret that the male folk must not get to know of. Can you do that? Of course, my queen. I understand the importance of this, so I'm not going to blow it open. I promise. I'm counting on you. Now, why is your face like this? I don't know, Mama. I don't know how and where I wronged Papa for him to embarrass me at every given chance he gets. With no remorse whatsoever, Mama. Chalo, what did he do? He embarrassed me again. It was even worse today. He saw me discussing with a young man, Mama. He had no idea what we were talking about. He came down from his car and abused the life out of this young man. Mama, why does Papa treat me like Wait, this? Why is your father like this? I don't know. Why is he blocking your way? Eh? <sighs> Mama. I am beginning to think Papa sees me as a loose girl. Mm -mm. That is not the issue. That is what it is, Mama. If not, what other excuse does Papa have to continuously embarrass me in front of all the young men he sees me with? What, Mama? I know the problem. Your father sees all men to be the same because he knows exactly what he does with girls behind closed doors. So he's trying to prevent you from being a victim. Ima no buma. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Really, Mama? Mm -hmm. hey. But Mama, oh, something will have to be done at this point. Because Papa cannot continue to embarrass me like this. Mama, I am tired. How do you think I look in front of this young man? How do you... Don't let that bother you. Mama, how can he not bother me? You need okay. to have been there. It's okay. Let it not bother you. Eh? When he comes back, I'm going to have a discussion with him. No. Let you know about that you want. Oh. Come. Hi. Where Take. are you going? I'm going for a meeting. Eh? Take care of the house. Hmm? <laughs> the dishes. Please wash them for me. The queen will soon be with you. That's okay. Um, is there anything I can catch for you? No, not at all. I'm good. Thank okay. you. Please do tell her that I'm still with her. She's away. That's okay. Greetings, my queen. 
Greetings. Please sit. Thank you. I was told you want to see me. That's correct, it's my queen. Who are you? My name is Ndoka. I came to see you in respect of your good friend, Chiso. What about her? Your Majesty, I love her. And I want to make her my wife. That's good news. I like good news. Thank you, Your Majesty. I am happy you're pleased with my intentions. Indeed, I'm pleased. Thank you. Have you spoken to her? That's where the problem is, Your Majesty. I tried talking with her, but the chemistry she's putting up is not encouraging at all. Okay. I'll have you know that if you must involve me in this affair, you have to fill me in with details of all that has transpired between the both of you up until this very moment that you're involving me. Oh, for Amadio has sick. What is keeping beauty? Huh? I told this girl the exact time to come to this place, huh? and, and she's still wasting time. I've been drinking and, and waiting. Can you find anything, Kabi? Look at the time now. I do that. Oh, she's here. Yeah, yes! Uh, uh, the, the door is open. <laughs> Hi! My peppermint. <laughs> My buttermint. Ew! Ew! Mm. Easy, easy, easy. Easy, easy. Huh? Easy, easy. Easy. Oh, go let them go. In fact, I'm no longer comfortable. Even. What about walk walk? Or do very well cautious or cool? Oh, no, come bullshit. Okay. <laughs> so. Hi, Wu. You kept me waiting. Eh? Sorry, mm. I was busy with some things at home. Oh, 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 yeah. Calm down now. Uh -uh, let, me, let me calm down first. I just entered. My body will make your body to calm down. My body is your eh? body coolant. Okay, okay. You know. no problem. <laughs> Since that's the way you want it. Mm. No, yeah, give me my money first. Beauty, why are you such in a terrible haste to call it money? See, Ichaika, I don't want stories that touch the heart. Be kokwa. Give me the money first. Beauty, you should know that I am a lover man. Eh? I am not like that now. You should know that one. It seems you're not even understanding me. I mean, nothing can happen between the two of us here if you don't give me the money first. You think I'm joking? Uh, 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 you see, what I want to tell you now is just uh, something that you can use your brain to understand. I don't have cash. Eh? I don't even need your money. I don't need cash. Just wire it into my account. I have my phone here. Send it. Ozubo, Ozubo, now you, you're wasting my time. Okay, this thing I am trying to let you know is that my mobile app, you started developing problem all of a sudden. <laughs> so uh, uh, as soon as we are done here, uh, I will do POS to you, uh, or possibly the uh, ATM at the, the bank at the village square. Uh, I will use my ATM and then access uh, okay. some money and give to you. That one is not a problem. Are you now. done? <laughs> you are very funny. You. Don't worry, you don't even need to. I, I came prepared. I don't want to stress you. I have internal POS. Don't wait. I don't understand. Wait, I have Which it. Which internal POS? Chenugodi. Wait. Oh, yeah. Hey! What is it? You have not seen POS machine before? Well, our camera is really on a new page. So you are prepared? Yes, yeah, so. I am fully prepared. See, me, I don't. I, I will block any avenue that will generate stories. So you really think that I am not serious? Oh, okay, let oh, me yeah. show you the. Nobody card. Your phone. Let me show you the card. This is the card. It's not as if I. Give have... me. Oh, 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 wait, 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 wait. Um, remind me the the amount we we, we talked about. Uh, yeah. uh, I I told you I needed to change my wardrobe, and secondly too. My phone is old. It's outdated. I need to change to a, a bigger one. Even a trouble. You see, go. 
in 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 the business. If I have a couple, what is the the end? The end justify the means. Oh, the, the total okay. sum. No when you're uh, in, uh, when you're in business, you do that. Uh, go One hundred fifty thousand naira will do. Hey. One hundred fifty thousand would have been enough to at least money to me. Is that but too much for you? I'm, I'm bad. No, if you cannot do it, let me go. No, that is I not don't what I'm saying. Stress. No, what I'm asking is this. So, Mbunye will have 50,000. Uzubo? Money for hand back for grant. Pay the money first, please. Don't stress me. Wait, wait. Let me put the amount first. Okay. Put your. Don't. Use one hand, just put your oh, pin. Oh, okay. Oh, that one is uh -huh. the easiest thing in the world. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, my wife is calling me. Um, I mean, the, the PG of the local government. Um, hello, PG. I, I am in a serious okay, meeting right now. Uh, so when I finish the meeting, I will come to your own meeting. Uh, Biko. <laughs> my ATM card now. Oh. Where is my ATM? I even forgot it's yours. Hey, well, don't, don't. I thought you left it for me. No, it to do what? Yeah. It's a little bump. I cannot kill you. You cannot kill me. Hey, what? 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 Hey, to make this girl believe that I really love her and that she's all that matters to me. What did she do again? Isa was now been calling her. She refused to pick my call. My phone will ring, 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 and she's just ignoring it. Why on earth? Who does that? She's not answering your calls. But why? Do I know? I don't have idea why she's not picking up. Eh? And it's not the first time, oh. It's okay. Don't let that bother you, okay? And I'm bothered already now. I am bothered. That's why I'm telling you now. I can no longer have, have her tolerate. I can no longer tolerate her like this. I mean, have her treat me like as if I, I don't mean anything to her. I mean, who, who does that? You know, for once, you just presented the truth. How do you mean? I mean, I'm glad you know she, she's not treating you as if you mean anything to her. That, that's the obvious truth now. I mean, I, I've been trying to hide this from people, but at this point now, I, I can no longer hide it. I mean, I have to speak up. You know, the man in you is beginning to come out, and I like it. But the question is, do you know why she's treating you like that? Do I know? Then you try and find out. How? How? Mm, ask questions about her. Okay, like sometimes, Mask a trail, okay, and follow her up. I believe you'll be able to find out some things about her yourself. Nah, Angela, Angela, I'm not that kind of a person now. That's not my nature. I mean, I don't have time to go and start monitoring a woman, the monitoring what she's doing now, trailing her about as if I'm her personal bodyguard. Let no okay now. Is that what I will now? Start? Is that a handwork or a profession? Me and what I'm time for this guy thing now. In over time, but let me tell you, that's what you have to do. Okay, yes, you have to find out about the woman you are about to settle down with. And yes, when you are done with your findings, just come back to me, because we have a lot more to discuss on this. Yes. Angela, why is he appearing to me as if there is something that I need to know which you are not telling me? There is nothing, just I want you to do the findings yourself, okay? Arako, I'm not joking. Do what I ask you to do. Angela, wait, so. You sounded so urgent on the phone. Yes. I hope all is well. All is well, my dear. Please sit. So, why were you sounding 
like that. Why? Sit down, please. Okay. I am seated. Talk to me. What is it? I want to start the conversation by asking you a question. Okay. I'm listening. Why did you decline Nduka's marriage proposal? Hey! <laughs> if you were not the queen of my land, I would have walked out on you right now. Are you telling me that you called me out of my house because of Nduka? A simple answer will be nice. If I had known this was about Unduka, I wouldn't have come here. Trust me. I know. And that's why I sounded the way I did. Well, tell Unduka that I am not interested. I'm not surprised. I knew you'd sound this way. Now that you have gotten the exact response that you were anticipating from me, can we discuss something else? Can I ask you another question? If it's about Ndoka, just believe me, I will not answer you. Why? Although this has nothing to do with Ndoka. It has everything to do with you. What is it? What is it with you and men? Why do you carry so much burden in your heart against men? Tell me about it. I do want to have that discussion. Why? Because I don't want to. Some words of advice for me will go a long way in fixing whatever line of thoughts that you have built over the years concerning men. What is this burden? Share it with me. I feel one mama if I get so boy. Beauty in one nemo if I get so boy. I will eat if I get the young man. Die. If I put in the door, I can never get a new bag I can never get a new bag in the air. I can never get a new bag in the air. I can You have to talk about it. For I see it is a burden you have carried on for too long. Please. Don't make me do this. Can I tell you the truth? Freedom of any kind is not gotten on a platter of gold. There are battles one must fight to end freedom. I tell you this. What is about to happen? 
is a battle you must fight for yourself. The truth is, I have already made up my mind that I will never, ever have any romantic dealings with any man again. Never. Are you happy with that decision? Yes. Yes, I am. I, I am happy. But your reactions betray you. You look to me like a woman who wants more from life in a family way. You must let go of whatever hurt you encountered from a man in the past and move on with another man. No. Their sins are unforgivable. I can't. An unforgiving mind. It's a grave that you carry with you for the longest time. It's time to let go. It's time to let go. Okay. If you want me to talk to you, then I'll talk to you. That's what I want. But just know that I will never have anything to do with Ndoka or any other man in this life. I will not do it. Well, you know what they say. Nothing except change is permanent in this world. Come here. There we are. <laughs> Make yourself very comfortable. No, 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 you can wear it. It doesn't matter. Oh my God. Your house is so beautiful. <laughs> I don't think I've seen this kind of luxury in my life. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. And very soon, it will not just be my house. It will be our house. Our house, Kwa? Yes. Hey, I, I hope I can get used to this luxury. <laughs> I'm not sure. Of course you will. And um, tomorrow I'll take you shopping. Shopping? Why? Um, just to get a few things for you, so you can look like a proper city man. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Ah, no, 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 no. I don't no, no, deserve no, no, no. you. Get up. I don't Get deserve up. you. Get up. I will forever be indebted to you. Thank you so much. You don't have to make a big deal out of it. It's just my own little way of telling you and showing you that I love you. Oh, I love you. With too. all my heart. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Eh? God bless you. <laughs> you. Thank you. Let me show you to your room. <laughs> Let's go. I know what I can do. I'm glad you know me too well. So better watch your tongue. Watch it, woman. <laughs> Ibe, you dare not. You dare not because I swear to God who made me. Try it and you will rot in jail. Hey, it's okay. Jesus, it's not okay. It's not okay. If it was his younger sister someone did this thing to, would he be happy? Tell me. Cynthia or whatever they call you. Can you please explain to me, how does this concern you? Huh? How does it concern you? How it concerns me. You want to know how it concerns me? Chisom here is my friend. And I will not watch you humiliate her all in the name of relationship. Who does that? I will advise you, you leave this house and go and mind your own relationship. Like this is your house? Mind your business. Like this woman. is your house? I say mind your business. Ibe, you are the most ungrateful human being on the face of the earth. A woman who feeds you, clothes you, shelters you. And all she gets is appreciation is you beating her up. Who does that? It's not your fault. Cannot be my fault. It's not your fault at all. Chisum. 
So you brought this thing into this house. What do you call a thing? To insult me. As of your house. I will leave. Oh, please leave already. If that's what you want, I will leave. But you. You see her face. If you don't want me to restructure your face, <laughs> huh? You better watch it. Watch your tongue. That's the worst you can do. That's the worst you can do. That's the best you, don't you can watch do. Your tongue, That's the best huh? you can do. If you don't watch don't your tongue. Don't point your finger at me, even. If you don't watch if your you tongue. Don't touch me. If you cannot talk, I will speak for you. What is it? I will speak like this. Watch your is tongue. Is that how they brush you up? Is that how your father beat your mother up? What's wrong with you? 